If you could deliver this list and the items on it oh, to the quartermaster, hello. Friend, she could get us what we need. It okay, I wasn't us, expecting this. But it would enable my healers to save many lives. Oh, would it? Then why haven't you walked like two fucking inches? All I have to do, Thren is the bitch outside, right? Who still worships Logan, despite him being the worst person in the world and also dying 10 years ago or something. Yes, it is. Well, here's a list. I don't know why I did this. Ah. Uh, well, have I not done it? What am I doing? Oh, I have to go ahead and inspect the requis where requisitions. There we go. Alfred and Blood Lotus. I can absolutely do that. There you go. Why am I the only person gathering herbs? Surely someone else can be doing this, right? It's not a particularly difficult thing. I'm meant to be saving the damn world. Anti Venom. Spider Icor, there we go. Spiders have become a problem for scouts. Inquisition healers have asked for supplies to increase our stores of anti Venom. Plus one power. Still don't have any of this silk. Surely silk. Can we just buy some fucking silk from Orlay or something? It'd be so much easier. Oh well, oh well, whatever. We At least we're getting more and more powerful. I absolutely will, don't you worry. Now, I'm gonna see if I can go to- Oh my god, that flag was quivering. Did you see that? No Must be so afraid of me. Alright, I'm gonna summon the War Council because hopefully, I'm hoping that'll reset Haven as well. So we can go ahead and- Is it Krem? Is that the name? I will never remember that name. It's so caveman-y and, and just out of nowhere. You're- you're trans, right? You have the opportunity to name yourself anything you want. And you go with Krem. If I'm even remembering it correctly. Krem, for fuck's sake. In the ridges in case there's any trouble. They are? Uh, okay, sure. Interestingly, the runes are Almari in origin, belonging to the tribes that inherited, inhabited Ferelden almost a thousand years ago. What is of greater interest, however, is that none of the runes translate intelligibly, meaning it is all in code. According to the translators, a reference to the Guardian also indicates an island off the northern coast. Most curious. I will continue translation efforts in the hope that we can narrow it down further. Here's we got 65 gold. Have we heard of the Almari before? Maybe similar to the Avar? I, I, I don't think we have heard of them though. Upon the waking sea, an offer from the blades of Hisarian, etc, etc, etc. Let's deal with the blades. Your worship. The blades of Hasarian keep supplies along the shore. Consider them at your disposal. Our former leader increased our caches significantly, although some of his methods were dishonorable. Or well, some consider his methods dishonorable. Ivor of the blades. They work for you. Let them keep their supplies. We know little of this group. Perhaps instead they have knowledge worth sharing. That sounds smart to me. We cannot openly accept stolen goods. Of course, we have no way of returning them, so we may discreetly take found goods. We could use the resources. Our soldiers can deliver them. No, I think Leliana, I think it makes so much more sense if we do Leliana's idea. Oh, give us your knowledge, my friends. Although they don't seem particularly smart to me. But who the hell knows? Upon the waking sea. The Almari runes, Calamari runes found in the mountain passages outside Haven have finally given up more, than, more of their secrets. You mean by finally? You mean in two seconds? Sure. Ah, uh, pointing to one of the larger islands off the northern coast of Ferelden. The island is quite large and covered in dense wilderness, so searching it will be an involved process. Uh, according to the runes, however, there should be some connection to the original disciples of Andraste and the Guardian of the Sacred Ashes. We, we know the Guardian. Furian met him. In fact, I kind of completely forgot that that guy exists. Oh, that is really, really cool. He never died, did he? He's technically still alive, or was it just, I will remain until my duty is fulfilled? I don't remember. I know a few adventurers trustworthy enough to send to the islands. Let them search and report back for, back to us. This requires stealth. A few skilled agents and enough time to quietly search the islands. Or well, as soon as we show interest in the area, others will follow. So let's go in force and occupy the islands. Is that a good idea? It's faster. Which confuses me. But maybe that's just because it's the most direct and terrifying. I don't think this is such a great idea, is it? Oh, what are we doing? I've always gone for the sort of assumption that faster the better. So I'm gonna send you, Cullen. But just because I need Josephine for other things and I know that. So, off you go, my friend. Please don't let this reflect badly on us. That would be awful. 
Oh, excuse me, awful. Jesus Christ. Head to Orlame and send Josephine to... We did that, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, the Chantry remains. Utilize the Great Warden Treaties. I'd like to do all of these. The Chantry remains. Ah, yeah, we already read this one. So it was deal with the bitches who are uh, denouncing us or whatever. Uh, we don't want them to die. Let's use Josephine. A delicate hand is needed. We should focus on clerics who can be swayed. Make their voices louder than those who oppose us. And that is the genius thing to do. So it is exactly what we will do. I like playing it smart. We're a fucking rogue. It makes sense to be a genius and not to go in full fucking force. I know. I like to think that your class sort of defines your personality as well in a little bit of a way. On the waking sea operation available. Yeah, I know. I just fucking did it. <laughs> what do you mean? Vivian, you got anything new to say? I should probably ask Sarah on Blackwall about Iron Bull. Yes. Nope. When am I ever going to be allowed to talk to my dudes again? God damn! Oh yeah, it's just bullshit Chantry talk. Alright, fine. Ah, uh, Sarah is in here. And Blackwall is relatively close by to Iron Bull anyway, but I might as well try with you, right? You really don't like me, do you? Any opinions about our allies? Again with your people. Yes, yes, yes. Would you also like to steal the clothes of Iron Bull, like everyone else? You make me wonder about things. I mean, what do their women look like? So woof. Woof. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Well, to be fair, I mean, we have also been doing the same thing. But everyone thinks that. Everyone just wants to be torn apart by that giant man. I mean, whatever, whatever. Can't, can't blame him. Can't blame him at all. So we'll go find a black wall. We'll ask him, and then we'll be on our way. I would love to see how Iron Bull and Varric interact, though. I just realized that they would be a fucking... I was about to say a riot. Why do I keep using old people terms? I don't know what the hell is wrong with me lately. They would be fucking hilarious together. And, um... I absolutely need to make that happen. I know, just the smallest boy we have, and, and, and the largest boy we have by far. Hell, even the way it looks would be delicious. Blackwall, Blackwall, where you at? Did I just slide down a person again? Why is this possible? What is the Frostbite you. engine? There are a hundred things that need your attention. You didn't have to take the time to help me, and yet you did. I haven't even done it yet, but uh, it if was a good cause, I guess. benefits the wardens, then it was worth it. Oh, hell yeah, even though you literally just did it, and I have done very, very, very little for you. But oh well. Ah, we will do there better. There be opportunities for us to do even more in the future. Then I look forward to it. Thoughts on the Inquisition? What do you think of the Inquisition? You already know what I think of your forces. I'm not sure what else there is to say. What about Iron Bull? I'm in a sure circle, blah, 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 blah. Comes. Wait, you what? Have, have you seen the stories Varric's been writing? Oh yeah, I forgot that we have to... Uh, I forgot that we don't actually get to choose who we ask about. He's the most annoying motherfucker. But, whatever. Krem is sort of my what last... What can I do for you? Yes! It's working! As uh, so we tried... Tell me about the charges, I believe. Right? Probably. How can we use I you? I said the chargers were at my disposal. Do you have any suggestions on how to use them? Nothing jumps out at me. If I come up with any ideas, I'll let you know. That's it? That it, That is lit- f Fine, whatever. I'd like Discuss to the bull the himself! The chief. Last time I met him, he saved my life. I never thought I'd work for Kinari, but he grows on you. He's not like any commander I've ever worked for. That's for damn sure. Okay, well, what kind of commander is he? How's Iron Bull as a commander? If you know what you're doing and hold up your end, he's easy. He doesn't accept any less. He keeps us alive, he leads from the front, and if you've an idea that'll win the fight, he listens. I've seen bands whose captains had to prove they were swinging the biggest sword. Well, isn't like that. The charges might give him more He very much seems like that. Laid down our lives for the big ass. Hmm. How did you end up with him then? How did a Tevinter soldier wind up in a Kunari spy's mercenary company? I wasn't a soldier at the Ah, time. Tevinter! I that explains the procedure. to flee Tevinter. A tribune and his men caught me in a border town tavern. They meant to make an example of me. Bull killed them. Gave up a 
his eye doing it. Patched me up and asked if I was looking for work. I've been putting up with his jokes ever since. Damn, you're the reason he lost his eye. I, I want to hear this story. That's how he lost the eye? Yes. The guards had me on the tavern floor when Vol came inside and yelled for them to stop. One of them saw trouble coming and figured he'd finish me off. The guard had a flare. Vol put himself between me and the blow. They can't, idiot. Didn't even know me. Is him being Kunari odd? It's strange to work for a Kunari. He hasn't tried to convert us to the Kune, if that's what you're asking. Vol's charges don't care who you light a candle for, so long as your shield stays up. If he hadn't told me he was Ben Hasroth, I'd have thought he'd left that life behind. I'm surprised he I told you. I expect he'd tell you all that he was a spy. Not the whole band, but those who've been around long enough to trust. He figures most of us would find out sooner or later, and it should come from him. Eyes to eye, he says. It's never messed up a job. Yeah. He just writes letters back home. Lots of the boys write letters back home. We'll all right then. I'll we'll see you later. I... I don't know. I... I I have a lot of questions about Bull and everything. Uh, it, it seems convenient that we didn't even learn about the tale about his eye. Well, not inconvenient. I don't know what I meant by convenient. It seems annoying that uh, we learn about the eye tale from Krem as opposed to Bull himself. And it's kind of sad that the tale is as boring as it is. Oh no, he jumped in to save the right hand. I, I, I'm sorry, I don't know which way you've transitioned. I, I don't know if you're a woman to a man or a man to a woman. I, I, I so I can't really. I, I, I'm gonna stop talking because I, I, I honestly, I'm not entirely sure what the right things to say are. So we're just gonna try to not pay too much attention to that, and we're gonna buy some new things. Refined breed in the common warm, common. Sorry, a refined breed common in the warm climes of Antiva. Suited to long distance and s distances and sprinted charges. Why are you free? I mean, I might as well, right? I didn't even know we could buy and sell horses. Saddled up, as if we weren't already very, very saddled up. Did I just trigger late or something? Never seen a fine amount. How are the horses? How are your charges? Well supplied. Haven is groaning under the weight. It wasn't built for this. But we'll make it serve. Any news, Pretty my friend? Worth noting. Too busy to hear things, and that's how I like it. All right, I'll see you later, buddy. Make be with you. I wonder if all the agents show up at the uh, at the Inquisition's home base. I haven't seen any, but it would be very, very cool if they did. All right, well, we're gonna make our way back to what's this? That's the war room. We're gonna make our way back to the Storm Coast. And I'll see you guys when we get back to where we were, but chances are we're going to be taken apart by a massive dragon before that happens. So, let's see what happens. Why can I not travel? Because you got to do that. It's so fucking strange. Where's the closest camp? And do we even have all the camps yet? No, we're still missing one. Damn. So I have to start all the way over here. Oh. Black. Dispatch for you. What the hell was that? We arrive and just black and then nothing else. Why would you? I hate when they steal a companion dialogue from me. Maybe I can go back and get it again and just immediately run away from the requ uh, requisition lady or spawn somewhere else. That is also an option. Have you, sir? Well, hopefully that means that the dialogue is sort of reset, I've because used, that would be very nice. I don't want to lose dialogue, because I think if it gets interrupted in the middle, it never replays, right? Uh, salvage ships. Salvage ships. Ooh. Okay, that's pretty cool. A number of ships washed up on the shores of the Storm Coast can be salvaged if they're used by the Inquisition. What am I using? Deepstalker hide, for some reason. I'm not sure. And cotton. What? What are you... What does that accomplish? Boats, apparently. That's what boats are made of. A number of ships. Yeah, okay, I literally just read that. Welcome to the Inquisition. Long ships? Oh, I would love to see us just ride in. Like, oh, get an Inquisition Navy. That'd be amazing. Oh, God, you'd want more? For you. What is Fine, it? what is it? You may want to look into this. <laughs> Even Darwin sounds pissed. Storm Coast, I, I, thought, I thought we'd already done the geological survey. You want me to just do it again? Okay. Why? Is it just an easy way to make endless power? What, you, you want it again? 
Maybe it is just repeatable, but I, d I didn't know that. That's dumb. Sure, what is report. This Salvage ship? Yeah, this is stupid. Why does this exist? Why do you just keep doing it over and over and over and over and over and over and over? I don't know. Fuck it. Let's get out of here, and if I see any companion chatter, I'll see you guys then. Because it's gonna take a while to get down to this fucking shard. Of course, it's only a shard. Ugh. Well, here we are. Back in what I can only imagine is the dragon's roost, but... Oh, I have missed Solus. I have missed that fucking barrier ability, man. We are untouchable! And since Iron Ball seems to be amazingly powerful, but very much a glass cannon for some reason, despite his endless mass, I, uh, I got the feeling this is gonna be perfect for him having Solus around. Oh my god! Is this a random attack that regenerates that quickly? Yeah, we're, uh, just a little bit unstoppable. Look at him go! Was that a lesser terror or a greater one? Oh, it still can knock him down to the ground, though. That's, uh, probably at least a little bit worrying. Bye-bye, <laughs> giant tree man. I don't even know what you are. You just disgust me. There we go. Something really weird looking about the terrors that just... Wait, what does this do again? I, I have no idea what that is. I think that's it. Oh, yeah, that's just my little, um... I do a little spin if I take a melee attack in that pose, right? I think, maybe? It's only a half health so far. Oh, and the ones I really didn't want to show up. Fantastic. <laughs> it's actually kind of fun playing as a warrior for once. Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah. I have the game way louder than it should be. The actual combat, don't I? I was wondering why my eardrums were about to burst. And no, 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 they got him. Well, at least we've still got one warrior to keep us alive. Just, I hope that's enough. I'm amazed that Darwin is still alive. Darwin never survives shit like this. Oh, and we don't have the VN. Hence why none of us are doing actual damage. Wait a minute, how the hell did he get back up? What? What actually happened there? I, I, I don't understand. But I'm also very, very upset that a warrior does more damage than the Jewel Dagger Road. At least right now. I must change down the line, right? There's no way they just neutered rogues. I require my testicles, you know. Come on, come on. And there we go. And that's another rift. Destroyed. I always do that out of time. It always just seems to take a completely random amount of time, you bastards. Right, uh, how is the armor you are wearing, sir? 75. I think I made better than that, didn't I? Yeah, it gives you even more willpower, too. Just makes you look a little bit more terrible. Uh, what was the ones you were wearing, then? Just apprentice armor. That looks way different. Ah, because it's apprentice male. Okay, I see. But armor should be better than male. Judging by what the game has taught us so far. I, I, I don't know. Ah, uh, free marches helmet. And you're still wearing one of these? Jesus. I can give you this warden helmet, apparently. I, I don't think that belongs to you. That very much belongs to my actual goddamn warden. Here we go! And you can have the griffin helm, because I like the way it gives health. That's a good thing. Ah. Uh, you can't wear it. Why not? Blackwall only, seriously? And it go on you? Well, you're not Blackwall, are you? I just hope we get some kind of Cunari friendly helmets at some point. I, I just, I genuinely don't know if they exist. And it would be very, very, very sad if they didn't. So what have we got around here? A single shard and nothing else? Well, see you guys soon then. No point just what? <laughs> I can't make you watch me pick up every single shard in existence. That is not the quality content you subscribe for. Unless it is, in which case, freak. Ah, yeah. I completely forgot about that house that we were supposed to loot. I believe this is where we first discovered the, the Sarian bastards, right? Oh, yeah, because they murdered our goddamn Inquisition troops. And now they are Inquisition troops. That, hmm, probably not the smartest idea getting them on our side, but... Wait, is this the house I needed a key to enter? Or is there going to be a chest I needed a key for? Just a back room. That's terrifying. Oh, that's really terrifying. What's the green glow? Oh, because it's grass. That would do it. That would absolutely do it. Notes found in a mage's hut. An excerpt from a manifesto on mage rights. The page is worn and creased as though read many times. Wait a minute. Manifesto? We know someone who used to like writing manifestos who maybe dabbled in just a little bit of magic too. 
Andrast I suffered at the hands of Magistus. Now shit, this is not Anders' voice at all, is it? And it probably isn't even Anders, but whatever. Now she feared the influence of magic. But if the Maker blamed magic for the Magister's actions in the Black City, why would he still gift us with it? The oppression of mages stems from the fears of men, not the will of the Maker. A few personal thoughts are scrawled below. Fears of men? If they stay away, there will be no fear. The place is remote enough. Strange to hear no one talking in the other room. To feel no eyes watching over me. I miss it sometimes. But if that was not the will of the Maker, then perhaps this is. Huh. Now what are you hiding down here, little mage boy? A lot of death! A massive amount of death! Mighty Offense Tonic. The Mighty Offense Tonic. I don't think we've ever even discovered a tonic before. This place is creepy. But, sure. Yes, it is. Oh, God, what's with the masks? And a lot of these guys are a lot more dead than the others. But I, I mean, I, I mean for a very, very long time, because some of these bodies are fresh. No decomposition at all or anything, and... Oh, that's scary. The fuck is with this little JPEG skull machine thing? What are you hiding in here? A wide greatsword grip? That's it? What, what the hell does that even have to do with magic? Nothing! You won't be able to use that! You d I guess he's keeping it away from the Templars who might eventually poke him with it. I... I, I don't know. You you miss the fucking staring of the Templars or the watching of the Templars, despite the fact you're committing some horrible blood magic sins down there. I I I, I don't understand. What the hell was that? Strarium's on the coast. Oh yeah, we should go ahead and explore that cave before we check out the rest of this giant island. Oh my god, a region I guess. It's not exactly an island. Let's go. Iron I oh, or not, no because immediate talkage, of course. Every time They're I try and jump cut. Secret police. Spies, basically. You spied upon your own people. Is that so different from Orlais or Ferelden? They have all kinds of people policing them. What they say and do, yes. Not what they think. What you think is what you say and do. No. Is it, Even though? the lowliest peasant may find freedom in the safety of her thoughts. You take Exactly. But I don't want you absolutely despising each other, so maybe call it a little- I don't want to say call it soulless, because it is technically the cue that's in the wrong. But I mean, at the same time, Iron Bull is so- So he's the most free Cunari I've ever met, that doesn't follow the cue in the slightest. He's not that single-minded, hive mind, weird bullshit that the Arashok and Sten were. And even the Arashok, he was a fucking criminal. He was not following the Kuhn. He was not following the orders of his higher-ups. In fact, he was actively going against them. So, how come he was still so very, very, very Kunari stereotype? Whereas Iron Bull is this. Is this the cave? Is this what I'm looking for? It must be, surely. Oh, God. The way that the, the sort of neon lines around what things you can interact with work, just, they really fuck your perspective up, right? I'm not the only one having issues with that. I don't know, it seems to mostly be with ladders, but I don't think this was the first time I noticed with it, noticed it, nah, 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 noticed it with other things as well. That being the fucking torches. That was strange. That was real, real strange. Get the hell out of here, spider boy. And what do we got in here? What is that sound? Okay. I thought that was disjointed singing, but no, it's just music, which you would not expect in a cave at all. Sure. I'm gonna wait for my invis to come back because it is basically the only way we survive as Darawen. Come on, come on, come on! Oh yeah, that's more than one? I did not notice. This is terrifying, but I also do have a barrier, so I don't think I have to worry whatsoever. As soon as we get the barrier, we become just as scary as basically everyone else in terms of constitution. Never mind, it's all gone. Oh god, run away. I like being an unbreakable rogue. We've never had a barrier that works so damn well, as far as I remember. There wasn't anything like that in the Origins, right? Like, you had things that could reduce damage, but never outright negate it until it went away. And I think that's really cool. Oh, wow, wow, wow! 
Level 12, the Prismatic Great Axe, and the Bane of Red Crossing, which is level 8. We can give that to Sarah, and I'm sure she will love it. What do we got in here? Oh, this is some good Kush, yo. Free Marches Banner. I still don't know what that's for. I don't know where we put that. I haven't really found a way to customize Haven yet, but... Oh, well. Ah. Uh, nice. I don't think anyone can equip their massive weapons yet. What level are you? Are, bleh, are we? We're nine, right? Is Darwin ten yet? No, we're all still nine. Which means it's gonna t If I'm nine, it's gonna take a, a hell of a long time for everyone else to get to, uh... 10, because I always reach it quite a bit before them for some reason, which technically means I'm a better fighter than Iron Bull, or at least more experienced. He's a Ben Hut. See, that just really, I hate that. What the hell is that? Makes it look like I'm behind the ladder? It, gross. Um, which means I'm more experienced of a fighter than a Ben Hasrath with years and years of experience who also ran a fucking mercenary band? And Cassandra has been the Grand Seeker, the right hand of the Divine for years and years and years. And I'm more experienced. Makes a lot of sense, game. Makes a lot of sense. Thank you. From here, where do we want to go? It looks like it's actually time to start exploring. I think first things first, I should probably set up the final camp in the area so we have full control of the Storm Coast. Except for what the Hussarians. Or the Hussarian Blades, is that what they were called? Yeah, what they have. But then again, they are now part of us. So we should be pretty much fine. Are you all shards? No, you're not. Warden things! Finally, we get to finish that off. Let's go. I believe we've also seen, look through all the ocularum, right? I, th I think, no, we can only see two more shards. So we're missing three. Now to be on the lookout for another little uh, bony bastard. For now, I'm going to take a swan dive off of a mountain and see what the fuck happens. Is it at least get us vaguely closer to where we want to go, right? Oh, that wasn't nearly enough off of the mountain. But it did absolutely shatter every bone in my body, which was basically the desired effect.